behind the castle. Shadows thrive in the darkness. Fair enough. But as a samurai, I can't let a rat like you escape alive. safe. Ranmaru, is that you? You must leave here quickly. We shall escape to the southeast. If the heavens still favor us, we shall escape alive. Mitsuhide, how could you do this to us? I'll protect my brother no matter what. Mitsuhide, you will not have my husband's life. His life belongs to me. Hmm. This could be a challenge. This does not look good. Lady Oichi, we all must follow our own path. You insist on siding with Lord Nobunaga, and I'll show you any mercy. Such amazing skill! I have defeated an officer! Finally... It's over. We won't be far behind! Let me know. This is what you desired, is it not? Farewell. Please wait for me in hell. I have defeated an officer!
une petite surprise pour toi. What is this place? Reina, what is that? Is your pendant lighting up? Huh? No, no, I don't think it's lighting up now. Do you, now? Do you read? Please respond. My communicator. Ensign Kenny, service number 00298. This is the Calness. Coordinates 33126. Two, two, three. Whoa, 10, what? Nine. Whoa, 10, what? Eight. Wait, no, seven, no, I, I can't eight, leave like this! Claude! Stay away! You're gonna two, get caught in it! One, what are you talking two, about, three. Claude? Claude! What is it? What's going on? I swear. I swear I'll come right back. Come back? Where are you going? <laughs> Claude! <laughs> oh, Claude. I'll wait for you right here. Still no good? You still can't get a hold of Lean. At this rate, we can't move. Marlin? What in the world is happening? Where is Lean? Justin? Why is Fina here? Lean couldn't have gone on alone. No, it can't be! All hands, as of now, J base systems are under my control. What? I repeat, what? all systems of J base are under the control Where of are Lieutenant you? Lean. Return immediately. Lean! I know you're there. Fina and Justin, too. I can feel Sister. you there. Sister, Lean? Now. We're about to repeat a tragedy of the past. I want to tell you something. Depending on the power of the Akarians, we'll only repeat the sad fate of the myths. I am here to put a stop to this operation. <laughs> The real power to save the world, that power rests in Fina, and not in me. That power is you, Justin. It's just, your power is still very small and hard to grasp. That is why I will buy you time. I will buy you just barely enough time to save this world. Perhaps to live means to repeat many mistakes. Gaia was also born from one of these mistakes. Mullen. It was you who said that these wings are the symbol of such sin. Yet, I am able to lessen the sins of those who may torment you. I can feel proud of even these cursed wings. What are you saying, Lean? I should be the one saying that. I wanted to release you from those wings that torment you so. 
that has been my wish for so very long. The people of the world mustn't repeat the same mistakes in the battles that lie ahead. They must walk a new path, fighting to create an unsoiled world. And the person that can do this is you, Justin. I know that it is you that can do this. You will find the answer that will break the chain of sad fate that binds this world. Wait, Lane! What am I supposed to do? Colonel Mullen, please hear me out to the end. I love you more than anyone else. Much, much more. Lean! Everyone's starting to leave. Can we go yet? Mordog Squadron, I told you to wait for the tanker plane above the carrier. I swear, man. Hey, what is that? Is my radar on the Brits? It's showing up on mine, too. Where'd it come from? How come the morons at Thunder Blockhead didn't notice it? Yo, kid! You have to call him Captain now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, you think we ought to report this? <laughs> Enemy approaching! All units, return to your combat air patrol stations! Protect the carriers! We have three carriers! Don't let them sink even one! Approach. 
Joshua Busto, former captain of the Ocean Air Defense Force, 8th Air Division, 32nd Tactical Fighter Squadron. His actions during the Belkin War are surrounded in mystery, and he is rumored to be one of the founders of a world with no boundaries. His whereabouts were unknown after the decisive Battle of Valdrike, but several years later he resurfaced as a leader of a terrorist organization. Today he is serving time in prison. This darkness and that little window are my entire world now. I'm actually rather fond of it. The darkness envelops me in a borderless world. A world with no boundaries. He was not the reason we were unable to change the world. No matter what the desired outcome is, the world can still change as long as people expand their knowledge and desire change. Today's world has already changed from what it was back then. Research complete. Milestone achieved. Thank you. 